case of necessity, uh, like it's, if it is a case of emergency, an emergency case, then we can directly call it. Now we had a, we had an example like with this day and that I showed you was we are missing here and we called them. But then you pick the call that's another matter. And the thing is that it's about necessity. If it is an emergency case, then we can directly call them. It, it's an institution, <laughs> and uh, more than it's securing social connections. And uh, and I have another example that. We all know that Delhi rape case and the protest it had uh, happened against uh, uh, that uh, protest against uh, Delhi rape case, and most people were there at that protest were university student people, and they all know, came to know about this uh, through social media. So social media in the in uh, there are a lot of other uh, like what to say negative things are there about it's affecting negativity. But still, it has some positive aspects like like this. Uh, so I think that's a positive and an advantage for social media, as your phone and everything. Yeah. So uh, my point is, we are basically living in the globalization age, and uh, <coughs> since we are in the globalization age, it is immoral to basically ban something which is of the present age, like mobile phones. And in schools, we are all learning day by day new things. And as we know, mobile phones with the new technology of internet, um, we get to know more stuff very, very, uh, very often. And like in the case of emergency, as she said, America, sorry, yeah. And uh, she said, in the case of an emergency, we need mobile phones at hand, and um, we should not ban mobile phones all together since uh, we can also put